the formidable robot. Ho ho ho! Hello, my name is Drew Pickles, and I came to say that a troll story was made about THX Tex as an early Christmas gift. This following story is about me taking down that robot fucker for murdering everyone over a stupid logo that isn't that scary, but the soundtrack is when you listen to it in ear raping volume. And just to let you know, Tex has the same voice actor as me, the iconic Microsoft Sam. Now with that shattered fourth wall out of the way, let's read the author's note first and then on to the masterpiece of the story. This story is a funny pasta and is therefore not intended to be taken seriously. With that being said, I hope you enjoy it and please make sure to leave your thoughts and feelings in the comment section down below. I was watching some lost THX text trailer creepypastas on YouTube to see how stupid the creepypastas are. I was trying to find a funny parody of a Lost THX Tex Creepypasta, and found a video called, Lost THX Tex Trailer, Group Pickles Kills Tex. I want to see what it looks like, so I clicked on it. Right before the video starts, there was a warning. This trailer was made to promote the release of the Rugrats movie, despite the fact it's not THX certified. Warning, you must be at least over 9,000 years old, and have 420 tacos at Taco Bell. A few seconds later, the trailer starts, and it shows a wide shot of the THX logo in a black background. Group Pickles then comes out. Hello, I am Group Pickles, and I am the most swellest man on the planet. And today I'm going to kill the fucking edgelord robot called Tex. I'm going to use this giant sludge hammer in my hand to kill him. He then gets the sludge hammer and walks into the screen. I'm going to kill him in every single way, including, but not limited to, slicing him up with a knife, choking him to death, throwing him in a trash can, shoving his head into a toilet, and shoving my fist up his shiny metal ass. After all, I'm the most swellest man on the planet. He will pay. Just then, it cut to that fucking edgelord robot, Tex. He said to himself, I'm fucked, that guy's going to kill me. All I have is my chainsaw. It's nothing compared to Drew Pickles' giant sludge hammer, but I'm still going to fight back and keep going. The trailer cuts to Drew Pickles again. He's walking through a door on the X of DHX, with a smirk on his face. I'm finally here, to kill the fucking edgelord robot called Tex. He walked in, then Drew took the sludge hammer, and was ready to kill Tex. And as you can see, I'm going to kill him with my giant sludge hammer. Just then, Drew took a swing at Tex with the sludge hammer, and Tex dodged. Drew took a second swing, and Tex dodged again. Drew's getting angry, because Tex is dodging his swings, and it looks like Tex is going to beat Drew, but that's not the case. You are so fucking screwed. You're about to pay for what you did to me, Drew Pickles. I'm going to kick your ass and take you down. He then took out his chainsaw and put it in Drew's neck. Oh no. That motherfucker got me with the chainsaw. But this is the point, he wants me to be dead. But I am not gonna die, because I am the most swellest man on the planet, and that motherfucker doesn't know that. I'm not going to give up, I'm going to keep on fighting and killing him until he's dead. The trailer cut to Drew again, and he had a determined face. I'm going to kill you. And I will get you, and it's going to happen right now. Because I am the most swellest man on the planet. He then took a swing with the sludge hammer, and he hit Tex right in the eye. Drew thought that he killed Tex with that sludge hammer, but that was the mistake of his life. The trailer cuts to Tex, and he has blood coming out of his eyes. He's angry because of Drew, and he took his chainsaw, and took it out of Drew's neck. I'm already out of my mind from the sludge hammer, but he got me again. My blood's coming out from the sludge hammer. Drew looked at the eye, and he had a smile on his face. Yep, you see that Tex? I got you again. I am gonna make you pay motherfucker. You know what's going to happen? I'm going to kill you. I'm going to finish you off. I am the most swellest man on the planet, and I'm going to finish you off you motherfucker. I am going to get that chainsaw, and I am going to kick your shiny metal ass, and I am going to kill you. You're so fucking screwed, and that's what you deserve. Drew then took Tex's chainsaw, and he walked in on Tex, with a big smile on his face. He then swings with the chainsaw, and smashes it right on Tex's arms. Drew then goes back, and takes the sludge hammer again, and then he walks in on Tex. 
Any last words, Tex? Tex just sits there, crying like the baby he was. Drew then went up to him, and then he said, I'm going to finish you off, motherfucker. It's going to be done. You're going to pay for what you did to me, and I'm going to make sure that you're not going to ever do anything to me again. Ever. I am the most swellest man on the planet, and you don't know that, and you're going to pay. Drew then took his chains out again, and put it in Tex's neck. He looked up at Drew. I hope you have a fucking good day, because you're going to die. Tex then chokes on his own blood. Then he dies, and Drew shoves his beheaded head into a toilet, and throwing his headless body into a trash can. Just then, it cut to the same shot from the beginning of the trailer, but Drew was saying, Tex dead, I'm the most swellest man on the planet, I saved everyone who is scared of Tex, and now here comes the most swellest part like Bag, that was swell. The trailer finally ended. I was happy that Tex got what he deserved, so happy that I copied and pasted the link to Reddit, Discord, and DeviantArt. After that, I went to bed, I had a weird fever dream, and no it wasn't about me getting killed or anything like that, stop whining. It was about me turning into Marker from Battle for Dream Island while being in the blabber zone from Twipsy the Animated Series. Well, that's all I have to say. Have a great day, and beg that was swell. Egg, that was the swellest funny pasta ever made in 2023, and this is my first and only appearance in that same year, because 2024 is about to hit the floor. It's been a year since I made an appearance in 2022, with pasta commentaries being, The Lion Guard Episode 0, Little Einstein's Lost Episode, The Dawn Is Your Enemy, Teletubbies Lost Episode, Drew Pickles Rules the Earth, which is not the one I'd expect, and Madagascar, the lost internship recreation of the facet chase scene with Gia the Jaguar. And just to let you know, in 2024, the shitty THX and Teletubbies pasta narrations from 2021 to 2022 are about to be moved to TVD 136, better known as the Video Effects Dweller, with major and or minor edits being made. Additionally for that channel, there's gonna be a few more narrations of passable and non-cringeworthy THX pastas, either done by Rohan Horton or anyone else. And oh, the voiceover and editing for these are gonna be a huge bitch. Now back on this swell THX funny pasta. My final rating is about to be a 10 out of 10 of swellness, cause fuck you Tex, who's the scariest creepy pasta villain of all time. Well that concludes this swell video. This funny pasta or troll pasta makes my day, credit to Narwhal Ball, who is the author, and I'm glad that robot fucker Tex got what he deserved for ruining Spin Pasta Wiki and the creepy pasta industry. I am Drew Pickles, the one of the kind swell soldier that brings you this message. Hey, that's my fucking one. It's, hello, I'm Dr. Reamson, the one of the kind soldier that brings you this message. And I'm going to kick your ass. Shit, it's one of those fuckers from that nonsensical and plagiarizing MS Paint abomination of a kid's webtoon, Greeny Fathom. Anyway, I will take over that so-called 1 to 3 Greeny Fathom, and then massacre the Greeny fuckers with my sludge hammer, and this is gonna be a tough one. Good luck, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and have a swell 2024.